So I'm not sure if this is what you're talking about, but just in case, you're just going to go and right click on the menu system itself and go to configure. So here you have your default. You can clone it. You can edit it. If you go to edit, here's your menu system. So I have flower shop. I have friends of the flower shop. And underneath friends of the flower shop, I have Wispy's Beauty Salon right here. Okay. These are all the different pages in your layout or different things in your layout that you can grab and use in your menu. So if I wanted to add another one under the flower shop, like this one, I can drag it where I want. And you can, if you want it to be a new one on the main line, you drop it here. If you want it to be under Friends of the Flower Shop, you drag it under. If you want it to be above or below that one, you drag it. Okay, so once you've got the page made, it'll show up under My Items over here. And if it's something that's not a page, but you want it to be in the menu, then you do Add New Item this way to add something that to your menu that's not one of your current pages already. All right. Pretty much it. Each one of these little uh, little guys here that gives you the option, you can go in and change the words. Um, you click on this button here, and you can change some actions of what happens when when you use it. But it's all under the configure menu there. You can also add another menu, right? You know, another menu, and then edit that one and stuff like that. So it's pretty robust. Let me know if that's what you needed or if that helps. If not, try to give me a little more info and I'll see if I can help more. Thanks.